Gabriela Castillo, My Personal Essay, in 500 words or less. Remember your mother's words as she told you what you needed to say in order to get into the building you would be helping her clean right after your Friday classes. Cuando llegues, when you get there, just tell the doorman you're here to help the housekeeper clean. Remember the moment you realize the disparity between your mother's modest appearance and the precious items she tediously cared for every single day. Remember the fear of becoming like every other girl in your neighborhood. Recall the moment I told one of my friends I was moving to the Bronx, and he responded, good luck, man. Don't get shot. Terrified of never being able to get out of my neighborhood. Terrified that if I don't get a college degree, I won't be anything in life. Terrified to watch my mom struggle to put a roof over our heads. I want me and my brother to be the reason why she doesn't have to worry anymore. I've never had somebody to rely on. Until now, now I have my college counselor and she's like, you know, me in the future, <laughs> I hope. The majority of my students do not have anyone. They're either first generation, they're low income, they're coming from immigrant backgrounds, the families don't speak English, the families are undocumented. His mother doesn't speak English, so I'm the one who really facilitated the whole college process for him. Defy the perception of your minority status. Take pride in the humbleness of your culture and the desert sand color of your skin. Pressure to be the first person in my family, the first generation in my family. To get the degree my mother never got. My parents didn't go to high school and they didn't go to college either. Honor the arms of the fatigued mother who awaits your arrival with a warm meal. I see myself in almost all the students that I work with. My folks did not go to college. They came up from the Caribbean, hardly speak English. My family is from Guyana. When we came to this country, there was no one to really guide and support us through the college process. When I went to high school, my guidance counselor told me that I couldn't go to college because of my grades. When I went to college, I broke a cycle. And that's why I work with my students every day. I try to be, for my students, everything that I didn't have. Determined to succeed. Determined to defy the odds. I've worked way too hard for this to give up now. I have to go to college. I am going to college. Surprised. At the amount of work that will go into applying to 16, 13, 25, 35 colleges. We know which schools will give better financial aid packages. We know which schools will work with students who have zero family contribution. Without her, I couldn't have done this. I have to go to homes or make late night calls because I need to make sure that they are shining through in each of their college applications. Grateful. Grateful. Grateful for my CVI counselor. That I had somebody to help me with the college process. Even when I wanted to give up, my CVI counselor kept me going. My CVI counselor is like a little blessing from heaven. She's not only my role model, but she's like my savior. She gave me hope and that's something that I really didn't have before. Dreaming. 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 Of becoming a music producer. Maybe one day becoming a doctor. I want to become an archaeologist. I want to like leave my own special legacy. My dream school is Columbia University. My dream school is the University of Florida. My dream school is Mercy College. Ithaca. UVA. Barnard Smith College. Columbia University. Temple University. Trinity College. I am actually praying to get into Syracuse. I pray for my students every night. Pray. Praying. Praying that she gets into Albany. That he gets into Rochester. Remember the pride you felt in getting that big package that said accepted. 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 Write your essay for those younger siblings. Groom them to practice the same perseverance and diligence with which you triumphed. Accept it.